So, we got hit with snow. We got hit with snow. Oh boy, we got hit with snow. Um, so this is what happened. We have been getting winter warnings for this weekend by Environmental Canada that Southern Ontario was just gonna get covered in white jizz. Nature's white jizz is gonna shoot all over the place. It's gonna be the most cum you've ever seen before, the biggest load you've ever seen before. It's crazy how much snow was coming to us, okay? So, I was working Friday night. I'm like, this is not bad. There's no snow, it's cold. I don't think it'll be bad. Fuck it. Let's see what happens tomorrow. So I leave work around 1 a.m. Saturday morning. I get home. That's when the snow starts. 1 a.m. Saturday morning. That's when the snow starts snowing. Okay? That's when the snow starts snowing. You know? The snow is going to snow. Alright? So it starts snowing at 1 a.m. Saturday. I go to bed. I wake up. And there's probably a good inch. It's probably a good inch. Inch of snow, okay? It's a good inch. It's a good, good inch. Like three, four centimeters on the ground. All right? So I'm like, okay. Snow's coming. I need to go get gas. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to go get some gas. Because I don't want an empty tank in this snow. Because guess what? Tank goes empty in this thick snow. Car is gone forever. Hands down. Car is gone forever. Whenever. Whenever. Forever. It's gone. So I went and filled up the tank that day and I get a and then I go fill up my tank of gas and I come back home and then I get a text message from Mr. Basso Basso man he said because of the weather uh it's progressively getting shittier and shittier and shittier and shit with more shit on top of shit with a layer of shit with diarrhea and then with more shit we got you a free room in the hotel so you don't have to drive through the shitstorm. So I'm like, awesome. I got a free hotel room. Gang, gang. So I was happy with that. So I'm like, okay, deal. I'm going to take this free hotel room. You know, whoopity scoop. So I'm at work. I'm working last night. It the snow progresses, so now we're throughout like a 24 hour period. We got now, I'm gonna say there's like nine, nine inches of snow, eight to nine inches of snow, and it's the shit, st it's shit snow. It's like the snow is frozen and it's blowing and making like snow walls everywhere. Okay, so I'm like, holy mother canucker at this point like snow stop the snow snow stop snowing okay that's what i'm saying right now snow stop snowing because i'm like all right click bang bang ba -ba -ba bang reload click bang bang ba -ba 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 bang ba bang ba bang stop with the fucking snow jesus fucking christ holy holy guacamole so I finish work, I go to the hotel room, I got a nice hotel room, I got two beds, I got a chair, I got the shitter, you know, it's a good time, comfy bed, I'm like, alright, it's not bad, took a shower, relaxed, I was like, I don't have to drive tonight anywhere, I got the setup at work, I'm golden pony boy, so, then, it's the next morning, I wake up, I wake up at 8 a.m. 
in my hotel room, I have a Keurig coffee machine. So your boy is making that Colombian coffee. Put it in the Keurig. Got a fresh cup of that confefe. You know what I'm saying? I got that confefe in the cup. I'm like, oh boy, this is some good confefe. This is some good confefe. I love my coffee sometimes, but I prefer energy drinks. But who gives a fuck, right? So, drinking the Colombian Cofefe, getting all my shit together. I go in my car. I bring all my stuff to the car the next morning. And I'm in the car. I'm in the car. Warming that motherfucker up. Car is covered in ice. I scrape, scrape all over the place. It's covered in ice. Okay. They plowed all the main roads. No problem. Side roads. Uh, basically, I want to grab a knife and cut my head off. Okay. I'm gonna grab a knife and cut my head off because these side roads now have like it was so much snow on these side roads. It was hitting the bottom of the door of my car, so that's a good, like, 10 inches of snow. 10 to 11 inches of snow. It's like 15 to 20 centimeters of snow. I'm like, wow. And guess what? It's still fucking snowing outside, okay? It's still snowing. Snowing. Snow stops snowing, okay? So... Now I try to go on the side street to the main street. Motherfucker, I get stuck, okay? I am having a mini a panic attack because I'm like, fuck me. I don't want to be stuck. I do not want to get stuck. So I'm rocking. I'm rocking and rolling back and forth. Rocking and rolling, rocking and rolling. And the shitty part, it's an incline like that, okay? I'm, I have to go kind of up to the main road. And this is the part that kills me. So this cunt in her pickup truck literally puts her turning signal on to turn to the road that I'm in the middle stuck in. There's no way for her to get around me. And you see I'm stuck. So first of all, you dumb cunt, why are you putting the signal on? And why are you gonna come in my direction when you know Eyes is stuck, okay? You dumb bitch! You dumb bitch! Uh, go fuck yourself! Uh, go grab a dildo and stick it in your ass because that's what you're good at. So, the bitch with her pickup truck basically looks at me and goes, Oh, he's stuck. Turns the signal off and then just drives off and is like, Fuck this shit. And disappears, drives away. I've had, I had like, 10 people drive past me, no one helped, because people are lazy as fuck, okay? So, this is how lazy people are. These snowplow guys get paid probably 60 to to $100 an hour to plow this snow, and half, they've only plowed maybe one-fourth of the city. One fourth of the city. One fourth of the city. You motherfuckers, okay? Fuckers. They plowed my parking lot at work, they plowed the main road, and then the side road, which is the main road that connects you from the main road to the parking lot, has 10 inches of snow on it. Oh! Uh, uh, you guys are fucked, okay? You guys are fucked. You guys are fucked. You guys are fucked. If you're the plowman, plow that part of the road while you're plowing the fucking parking lot. Or I'm gonna grab the plow and plow rip your asshole in half. Cause I was stuck for 15, 20 minutes. Then I had to drive from one town to the other town home through ice hell, which was fun. Then I hit my side road, and I'm fucking ripping it in the snow because I had to turn the acceleration control off in my car. 
So my tires were just all fucking down. I was basically driving sideways for a kilometer. I was driving sideways for a kilometer. That's how much snow there was. Uh, they're like, you know what? Go fuck yourselves. You know, you knew for a week and a half that this much snow, this much snow was coming. And guess what? You did fucking nothing. You did nothing. You did nothing. You did nothing, city. So guess what, city? Go fuck yourself. And it's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. Then I see my father's at my house. And I see him in the middle of the driveway. And I honk at him to get the fuck out of the way. And I come sideways like this. Halfway up the driveway. And then that was it. I got home finally. I got home from this shit storm. And I have to go to work. I gotta go back to work later today. And I'm like, oh! I'm gonna kill myself, so that was like my morning. That's the shit that I had to deal with, and it was fucking just kill me now bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Kill me now. Snow. Snow, stop snowing. That's what I'm wishing right now. Snow, stop snowing. Crazy. Crazy.